So after running the raid numerous times I noticed something real strange. I then asked on my discord if anyone else had noticed anything unusual about the raid. The reaction was crazy, I then jumped on reddit, did a little search only to be hit with many many posts about the very same problem I was experiencing. Walton isn't dropping any of his exclusive loot. Like really? How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and today I bring you another BL3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you do want to see more. Also before we go any further, for all your gaming needs, no matter the platform you play on, at amazing prices with incredible weekly deals, check out G2A, linked within that video description. So the issue I thought I was the only one having, it seems as though in fact it's a widespread bug. And that is the fact Walton actually doesn't seem to be dropping any of his exclusive loot. Exclusive loot being the redistributor, the Tig's Boom, the Moonfire and the Kib's Worth. So if you guys are doing a raid farming for these weapons, well I'm afraid to say you are wasting your time. I mean the footage in this video I recorded literally just before making this video, I ran a raid 10 times in a row and absolutely nothing, not a single thing in terms of his exclusive loot. At the same time I had numerous friends doing the same thing from all over the world on different connections and so much more, testing this and nope not a single drop exclusive loot wise. Now it hasn't always been this way people, in fact this is an issue that sprung up and hit us with the latest hotfix which came out last Thursday which would have been the 14th of May. In this hotfix they spoke of changes being made to the raid and the way loot dropped. They said the following. Change the dedicated loot pool for takedown at the Mallow and Black Sites boss and minibus, Walton and the Valkyrie squad. Increase the chance for more than one legendary to drop from dedicated loot pools of the boss and miniboss in the takedown at the Maluan Black site. We thinned out Wharton's dedicated pool with today's hotfix. As a result, the Valkyrie squad now drops the takedown at the Maluan Black site shields exclusively from their dedicated loot pool, while Wharton drops the takedown at the Maluan Black site's weapons from its dedicated loot pool exclusively. This does not affect will drops from these enemies. Paired with the change to allow more than a single legendary to possibly drop at one time. Players should have an easier and more consistent farming experience in this content. Well people they weren't shitting us when they said they were filling out their loot pools. Because that's exactly what it seems I've done. So yes people, this is where the problem arose with this hotfix. Somehow after trying to help us out in getting more of that loot we want, Something went terribly wrong, and they somehow disabled the ability for Wharton's exclusive loot to drop. Now this does indeed suck, because I know many people are still out there farming certain roles, which are exclusive to the Revenge of the Cartels event, which isn't here for much longer. So when this event does end, so does your chance of getting those certain roles. So the longer this issue goes unchecked, the less likely these people who are farming certain roles will actually obtain them. Which is a problem. Now I've looked on YouTube and I didn't find a single biggish or relatively biggish content creator covering this issue, so I thought I'd do my thing to help you guys out, hoping Gearbox will somehow see this and do something about it. The problem it seems is a new one and it hasn't been in place for long, but let's just hope they sort the problem ASAP. Even reverting the changes made in the latest hotfix I believe will sort the problem as before this, before this hotfix I don't recall any issue with specific drops only a lack of them, which indeed is what they tried to fix or help us out with. So yeah guys if you could hit that like button as the more exposure this video gets the more likely it will get their attention. So rest assured people if you are farming the Maliwan raid, you are farming Wharton and you're not seeing any of the Tig's Boom, the Redistributor, the Moonfire or the Kib's Worth's drop, it's because there is currently a bug in place, which for the most part isn't dropping any of these weapons for anybody. And on that note, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Borderlands, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video, I upload content notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.